There are three sides to every story, yours, theirs, and the truth. Every person and source of information places their own personal biases on the information that they share with others. When it comes to current events, politics, or even who forgot to take the trash out, everyone twists information to suit their narrative. Many people practice a bad habit called ignorant certainty. Ignorant certainty is the belief that there are definite, correct answers to everything, and that all you have to do is find the right source. The answers to most meaningful questions are rarely straightforward. A true man knows this fact. In order to improve your intelligence and make wiser decisions towards success, you must be able to traverse through opinions and grasp the facts. Only base your next move on the truth, just the same as you move forward in life off of your own truth. Here are five powerful techniques that when employed will allow you to take back your mind. Number one is to question everything. Even when presented with statistics, the wording can be made purposely complex to confuse others or be slanted to fit a narrative. Never take anything at face value and look into the credibility of what is being presented. Part of thinking critically is evaluating the validity of arguments. Number two is to be open-minded. If your crazy neighbor has a conspiracy theory about the existence of life on other planets, or your uncle reveals to you the next million dollar investment, hear them out. This doesn't mean that you have to agree or accept anything that is said, and you must question them as discussed in step one. However, failure to accept the ideas of others based on your own preconceptions could lead to your downfall. Because what if your uncle is right? What if there is information that you never considered previously? Being dismissive prevents you from gaining intelligence. Instead, keep an open mind and research any and all information that is presented to you. Figure out the truth for yourself and then make a decision that you decide to take. When it comes to politics, people are very polarized and often demonize the opposing viewpoint. However, there are several aspects of both ends of the spectrum that you may actually agree with, but have never allowed yourself to better understand it. The key to depolarization is through an open mind and critical thinking. Number three, never get your news from one source. When you hear or see new information about something and it really interests you, don't simply repeat the info from the first TikTok or news source that you read. Take the time to look at articles from multiple points of view and gather the similarities between them. These similarities are likely the facts of the story, and then you can base your own opinion off of these facts. Number four, reverse the logical flow of information. When people tell a story, they go from A to B to C. Very often, some action that occurs in event A causes event B, and then event B causes event C. This cause and effect process is how the importance of an event is shared. However, rather than following the typical train of thought, flip it around. Would C be the sole outcome from B? Would B be the sole outcome from A? By carefully considering the cause of each effect, Rather than simply looking at each effect, you will often catch mistakes and realize at which point things went wrong. If you misspoke to a coworker or a partner, this is how you can think critically about the situation and realize where the conflict escalated. Furthermore, correlation does not equal causation, and there is a chance that a situation may or may not repeat itself. You must be vigilant in your introspection during this process. Lastly, you need to practice balanced thinking. You may ask what exactly this balance is or how to achieve it, but it is really quite simple. A man must not underthink and fail to think analytically about a situation. If you are too tired to give your brain energy and focus on the issue, then you should not be giving an opinion at this time. 
Think carefully about what you want to say before you say it. However, don't overthink either. Many individuals get so caught up in the various outcomes and risks that they, they fail to act and allow anxiety and second guessing to occur. Think things through to reach a conclusion, but you must balance between underthinking and overthinking. This is a delicate skill, but one that you must master in order to become a high value male. A high value man uses these five techniques to develop their critical mind. A critical mind is a sharp one and allows you to look past the mirage of fallacies that exist in society today. Once you can analyze and understand the world for what it truly is, you can break down and create a plan to conquer it. Becoming successful is more than just knowing how to make money or how to get into shape but it's a combination of how to utilize these assets to raise your status. This is why your mind is the greatest weapon in your arsenal, to combat the binds of mediocrity. You must first find the world's veracity before you find your own. Think critically and show the world what you are capable of. That's all for today, Kings. Remember to like and subscribe.